my brain tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick follow up about the Windows update issues we were posting on last week for Windows 10 and Windows 11. And for Windows 11, the update was 5029351. And for Windows 10, KB5029331. Now just a quick recap, Microsoft had received reports of an issue in which users are receiving an unsupported processor error message with a dreaded blue screen of death after installing um, those optional bug fix updates that rolled out for Windows 10 and Windows 11 last week. Now, since posting late last week, um, just to let you know that Microsoft has now updated its health dashboard page uh, for this known issue, where they've said that they are investigating the issue and they have found that the unsupported processor error was not caused by issues in KB5029351. So clearly Microsoft is not wanting to put the ball and the blame for um, the dreaded blue screen of death unsupported processor issues in their courts, so to speak. They've also said that they are collaborating with device manufacturers, which are the OEMs, and to uh, temporarily uh, mitigate this issue, they will not be pushing out KB5029351 to Windows devices that might be affected by this issue. And I did post on that late last week, and I'll leave a link to that video down below if you would like some more info. Now, as I've mentioned previously, um, this issue is mainly affecting MSR motherboards. And late on Friday, MSR has also responded, saying that this issue is mainly affecting the 600 and 700 series motherboards, irrespective if you have an Intel or an AMD processor installed. And MSI said that they are investigating the issue. And while the investigation is underway, they recommend that all users temporarily um, stop installing or refrain from installing those updates uh, in Windows, and they will keep um, everyone updated on the progress of their investigation. Now, since they have um, responded, they've also issued a temporary workaround. And MSI said on their website that if you have already encountered this issue, KB5029351 might automatically be uninstalled to allow Windows to restore to normal. However, if the update is not automatically uninstalled, uh, they recommend reverting your BIOS to the previous version and uninstalling KB5029351 from Windows because the issue is um, caused with the motherboard and obviously um, when you restart your device, it won't let you in. It gives a blue screen. So obviously you cannot uninstall the update, but reverting your BIOS to the previous version, they say, will obviously um, give you the ability to then log back into your system where you, you can then uninstall the update. And if you don't know how to roll back and revert your BIOS, um, they say if you are unsure of how to restore to older BIOS, this video link will help you on how to flash BIOS on MSR motherboards. And you click on this link and it'll take you over to a video and where MSR explains and walks you through that process. And I'll leave a link to their website down below for easy access and reference where you can get access to all that info. But just wanted to put it out there and keep you posted if you are affected by this issue. And um, if any more info becomes available regarding uh, the unsupported processor with the dreaded blue screen of death issues and problems, I will obviously post and let you guys know. And obviously, we are hoping that either Microsoft or MSR does, does roll out a fix sooner than later, but I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.